Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is Division 101 and today's tutorial we are going to learn how to create a five pieces wall art canvas in our PowerPoint. So let's get started. Let's get started. But before that, please don't forget to subscribe our channel, Division 101. Click subscribe and click also the notification bell so that you will be notified for our new videos in our channel. So we will open now our PowerPoint. So this is our PowerPoint. And then we will use blank presentation. Remember that our purpose for this tutorial is to create a five pieces wall canva or poster so we will be using the blank okay so we will just delete this one delete this slide and we will use the blank slide so this is it so start with the home and go to the shapes click here and then after you click you create a shape like that Okay, so we have our shape now, shape number one. And then next, we will copy and then paste. So we have, or if you know already our shortcut, all you need to do is to control C, control V, and then you have now your second uh, shape. So we will uh, make it smaller for our second shape and then like that and also this one you can see you have the line dotted line meaning to say that's the same size with the second shapes so the second one is control c copy control v put it here and then after that you resize a little okay smaller compared to this the, the second shape so we have here like that and all you need to do is to control V, control C, and then you copy to the other side. After that, you will adjust the size of your shapes altogether to fit in in our layout. So hold control and then click each one. So you choose everything. And then after that, you can resize now your picture, okay, or, or your shapes. Or if not, you can also do like uh, home or format. In the format, you can have the group. So click group. And then you can now resize the shapes that you lay out in your slide. So we need to say this one now is in one group because we already grouped this one. So just go to group. Uh, that's under format and then group. So this one now becomes one uh, one group or one shape. So the next one is we will fill this one with a picture. So just right click, fill, or here you can uh, write, you can see here format, shape, fill, click, picture. Now in your click picture, you have, you have, an option from your file if you save your picture in your file or from the online so we will go to the online for example we will see city sports cars or sport car select and then after that you select picture or a car that you want to use for your layout okay so for example this one and then insert and you can see your car now is in the layout. Okay, after that, right click again. And then format shapes or shape. Then go to shadow. This one. Shadow, click shadow. Change the color to black. And you can see you have your shadow now. If you want to make it bigger, you can adjust. The angle you can adjust. But for this tutorial, we will stick on what the the setting of our of the shadow okay but if you want you can adjust different setup of your shadow it's up to you so after that one you also change the 
line, make it bigger and make it black, color black line, and then you adjust the size around three points. So you can see you have now the outline of your picture. And then, so almost complete, click the slide, and we will fill in the white part of our slide to a gradient color. So we will change the color for our gradient, uh, gray. We will remove the other one and then lighter gray. And then here is white color. So here is the fill gradient. So I adjust and then we will make it a radial, radial color. Okay, and you have the option here. You can see you have a radial color and you can adjust now that the gradient of the colors. Okay, if you want more darker color, you can adjust like that and also adjust here to emphasize your background. Now, this is how to create the five pieces wall canva, canvas or a poster. So you can adjust this one and then you can lay out by yourself. So hope you learned something in our tutorial today. And this is by using our PowerPoint. This is David June 101. Thank you very much and have a nice day.